for mobilization of that first MP joint. This is how it looks on an actual foot. So I don't want to compress the nail bed or flex this IP joint. The joint I'm actually going after is this the metatarsal phalangeal joint right here. Okay, we also want to avoid val varus or valgus movements on that joint. So we want to keep it fairly neutral and just stretch into the sagittal plane. I want to stabilize the first metatarsal. So I'm going to come behind the thicker area of that joint where those sesamoid bones are, dropping back and stabilizing here. While I grip just the short bone here, that, that first phalanx, and I'm going to distract and drop down and I can then, while still stabilizing that first metatarsal, I'm gonna apply a little over pressure with my other thumb and stretch that into plantar flexion. We wanna gain about 15 to 20 degrees in this direction.